أعوذ بالله من الشيطان الرجيم بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم تبت يدا أبي لعب وتب ما أغنى عنه وما هو وما قسب سيسلى نعنا ذات لحب وامرأته عمالة العتب في جيدها عبل من مسد صدق الله العلي العظيم السلام عليكم My name is Murtaza Adelji. I am 35 years old and I've studied in University of Westminster and I am a British Muslim. Family means a lot to me. Alhamdulillah, I've got a son who really inspires me. My son named Mustafa, he is a really inspiration as I feel I can guide him on the right path and to teach him Quran which really makes me feel better. I worked at Northwood Nursing Home. I started in October 2010, my main role was doing the database uh, information and, and the training. The atmosphere working was really good because it, it, it was 30, it's a 35 bed mental nursing home for all ages. I work every day, Monday to Friday, but I've got a, a 32 hour week. So if I finish 32 hours, I don't need to go over it. I used to travel to work with my car because I'm based locally. But then now, because I stopped driving, I use a mobility scooter to come to work and mainly I normally start at eight in the morning on a day-to-day -day basis. As a young Muslim, I, I feel equally with all the different religions I feel I don't feel any any biasness but I feel after finishing my degree in University of Westminster I feel that each and every one can equally can equally feel confident in whichever religion they're in. Being a young Muslim brother, I, I personally feel I have achieved and I can still achieve what I want to do in the future. Even though I'm a Muslim, with going through different challenges, everyone will have to face a challenge in life. With prayers, I try, I honestly try to keep praying on time, but at times it's difficult, especially when I'm in bed at super time, if, if, if not going to mark to pray in bed with, uh, with my disabilities. At times, 
to praying on a chair it's easier but but I feel more to Allah. Uh, I feel my prayers accepted more than when I'm in bed and praying in bed. But generally, I try to keep my prayers on because in the past, when, when I wasn't focused on prayers, it definitely had a direct effect on my body. The month of Ramadan, I'm looking forward to with all the benefits received from that month and hoping to achieve my best hopefully this month of Ramadan. My strength in, in the holy month of Ramadan is uh, hoping to com complete the whole Quran if not twice, once. And my weakness would be if I have a medical issue which stops me from fasting. For the month of Ramadan, I feel, I feel that my prayers are mostly accepted because even though being a Quran teacher for 18 years, I still managed to finish one to two Qurans in a holy month. When I was 14, my mom woke me up for school, but I couldn't get out of bed. And it was a shocking for my parents because they didn't understand what was happening to me. It was a disease till today. No doctor has known exactly what's wrong because every year I go to different doctors. I've even gone Wrong. I've even had medication, 26 tablets a day for 10 years. But now, no, I'm not allowed to take any medication because it was, it did not serve the purpose. But till today, and no doctor knows exactly what's wrong with me. As a British Muslim, I feel proud to be one because I have the, all the facilities like with the people at the mosque and just the, the freedom of speech and just uh, to make it easier with all the different skills like being a teacher, going with, with my scooter locally and to continue all my prayers, which gives me satisfaction and sukoon. So cool.